Hi, this is Dr. Pan, host of Tucson Math Doc channel on YouTube. Today we have a very interesting SAT ratio problem here. A total of 120,000 votes were casted for two candidates. If Garcia won by ratio of 5-3 and they want to know what number of votes was casted for Peter. Well, the best way to sh solve those ratio problems is well, what we call using the bucket method. Okay, so since ratio is 5 to 3, we'll put a ratio on this side. Okay, and the total number of votes we'll put on this side is 120,000. Okay. Now, because this one is on the ratio, you don't really know what the number is, but the total bucket altogether is 8 buckets. Okay, so since we're looking for a ratio of Peter, and then Peter has three. So let's put a Peter here and Garcia here, because Garcia will win, won the election. So Peter's ratio is eight out of three, or three out of eight. So for every eight votes casted, Peter got three. How I know that is because there's a five buckets ratio and three here. Altogether, I have a ratio of eight. Okay, so putting in the ratio, because uh, Peter was getting three out of eight. Now here's the trick. You gotta line it up. If this is the total ratio, and then you need to put a total votes over here. Okay, X is where we wanna find out for uh, Peter. Okay. So on this side, this is the actual votes. On this side, we have ratios. Okay, so it's basically, um, apple to apple, orange to orange. Okay, from here it's really easy. All you have to do is what we call a butterfly. And then all butter butterfly is really saying three times 120,000 is equal to eight times x. Okay, from there we solve for x is equal to three times 120,000 divided by eight. And I believe this one is 45,000. Okay, all right, hope this helps. Have a confident day.